Hi viewers, welcome you all to the 52nd edition of the Mysore Sport YouTube channel. Today's subject is badminton. Badminton is very popular in the sporting world throughout and India has been faring well excellently in the world scene also. With the exploits of uh, Prakash Padukone uh, in the badminton world, uh, badminton picked up in India and over the recent two decades are uh, badminton players like Sainya Nehwal, uh, Sindhu and Pranoy all have uh, uh, geared up and gave, uh, have given a brilliant show in the uh, world scene. And our uh, doubles players Swastik Raj and Chirag also have done everyone proud. So on these lines, a 14 year old girl from Mysore has been doing excellently and has been part of the uh, junior, sub junior, junior and the senior women's team uh, of Karnataka. She is none other than Jade Anil uh, from Mysore. Uh, on this occasion, I uh, wish to welcome her for our Mysore Sport YouTube channel interview. Welcome uh, Jade Anil for our interview. Thanks for having me in your Mysore Sports YouTube channel. Yeah, congratulations uh, Jade uh, for having selected uh, for the Karnataka team in the under 19 and the senior women's team. How do you feel uh, getting into the team and uh, uh, performing uh, the tournament is going to start uh, from tomorrow I'm in sorry. Bangalore? Well, how are your preparations? So I feel really great and I feel happy to play in the team especially for a bigger category and my preparation for this uh, tournament is my normal training basically so my peaking season so that is mostly focusing on the on court fitness yeah uh, now uh, you are just 14 years and it's quite it's a record of sorts uh, uh, for a young girl to play in all the sections uh, uh, representing karnataka uh, when did you start playing uh, badminton? How uh, did you take interest in choosing this sport? So I started playing badminton when I was 8 or 9 years old and the reason why I started was because my mom had to keep us all three of us occupied. So I fell in love with the game right when I started playing and I wanted to play more in my first session of the day. So I felt like on the first day I wanted to take it professionally. Which year was this? 2017 or 18. So that okay, good. Uh, how do how did you start? Where did you go first to learn? Who was your coach? How how did it go on from there? So my first coach was Ramsa. I started in Mysore itself, and from Ramsa I went like I since I wanted to take it professionally, I had a personal coach from Indonesia. So yeah, that's how it really started. Which was your big break of uh, winning a tournament and getting that uh, uh, in your mind that I can also do well so uh, in the uh, professional scene, which big tournament or uh, which t tournament win did give you a boost? So this was my first singles title under 19, my ever first singles title under 19 in Raichur. So that really broke my uh, shyness, my illness and really gave me confidence to pursue and I can, yeah, I'm, I'm at that standard so I can go on further. You won the title? Yes. Good. And uh, how, how are your work ethics, uh, uh, your nutrition, your uh, diet and your uh, fitness regime? You have to, when you are professionally uh, uh, becoming a, a player, you need to have a good uh, diet, uh, good fitness regime and also uh, a skill development. What, what are your uh, uh, good at and where do you need to improve? So yeah, for me, my fitness is what I think is giving me my um, upper level against all of these players and so yeah and my nutritionist I have a personal nutritionist as well and I have a personal mind coach as well so um, where I need to improve I, I feel is my stepping in the court so basically my how many hours movements. do you practice daily what is your work regime and how how do you keep yourself motivated uh, doing all these things where, where, who, where, where are you based? Where are you uh, presently training at? So I'm presently training in Hudson and right now since it's my peaking season I play almost four hours on court 
and then two hours of fitness. How was your experience playing the national tournament in Coimbatore recently? So um, that was interzonals. Yes, I played that tournament and it was team event and it was kind of fun as well as pressury at the same time because my team is depending on me and we reached the finals but unfortunately we lost in the finals and uh, it was a tiebreaker where I had to play my singles. So that's where we lost and then we got runners up. How was his experience uh, playing against different uh, state uh, members and also you had to play uh, in the team as well as in the singles also in, in the uh, uh, single event. How was his exposure giving you a Philip to your uh, confidence? Uh, it gives me uh, a good boost and my exposure was kind of a bit confusing because there were new players and I tried to think more and in my individual offense I didn't play really good and I didn't get more so. Uh, do you think playing more and more tournaments would give you more exposure and uh, help you to improve your uh, skill against players whom you don't know? Because uh, uh, this uh, will help you in uh, improving your skill uh, in different uh, types of uh, situations against different players. Yes, definitely it will help and playing more tournaments that means overcoming your more fears and uh, yeah, playing against other, all sort of different type of players gives you a lot more experience and like more to play. So it definitely helps. Where are you good at? At the net or you're a defensive player or you're an attacking player? Where, 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 where do you think you are good? Where do you think you need to improve on? So I think that I, I'm an, I, I am an attacking player. And I have to work and like where I'm weak at is my stepping again. So, yeah. So what did, what presently you are training with an Indonesian coach who is, uh, uh, who is helping you. Uh, what does Hansen uh, try to do to improve your skills and uh, your fitness? Uh, you were training with Mr. Prabhakar. Uh, what, what were, uh, what are the things which you do? So I trained with Tree Coach for about seven months, and in that seven months, I was training with Prabhakar sir for my uh, athletic, like running and all of that. It really helped me. Uh, we went to ovals there, and then I have my gym sessions and my agility sessions, which are taken care of Siddhesh sir. Okay. So that was another personal session for me. So and then now, now currently, I train in Hatson, where they're giving me a really good. They give me lots of facilities and more players to play with. So yeah. So how was this uh, experience of uh, putting all these together uh, combined with your nutrition, fitness, skill as an overall developed player? How do you feel you can match up uh, to the uh, other players who are in the top ring in the national level? So currently, I have everything. At, like with me and everything's right there. I, it's me that I have to. I have to push myself a little bit more. I'm almost there. I have to just a little bit more for me to catch. I'm not really that far away from the national level. Yeah. Yes. So what are your further goals and what are your further uh, uh, interests uh, in in this game? Because you are young. You're, yes. It's a learning process. So you are going through it and you are emerging as one of the shining stars so you need to you need to have a positive curve uh, so in order to do that what steps do you think what are your further goals uh, in this sport so my goal for right now is to win nationals under 17 so yeah i want to win nationals singles under 17 and for me to improve is just to keep going on and work on my mind and work on everything and just condition everything else. So that's what I think. So every every child has a love, uh, lovely parent uh, support. And how is your support from your parents? So my parents have played a really important role till now and then I'm really grateful for them. And my dad is the one who pushes me a lot every day. I think he, he's the first person in the house to wake up every single day without fail and then he, he pushes me on the bed, he goes, Jade, wake up! To go and I'm like, oh, I don't want to go for fitness. He'll be like, no, you have to go, otherwise so many people are going to overtake you and like stuff like that. And then he's the only one who doesn't Motivator. keep me. Motivator. Yeah, 
and mm. he doesn't keep me falling off my track mm. keeps me right there mm. and obviously yes i have to do it by myself which is happening now and my mom as well she also does a lot of things for me and then um she cooks my food really well and she also actually motivates me a lot and then when my dad scolds me or like really puts like sometimes he puts a lot of pressure my mom's there always there to comfort me and help me play better in my matches and she's there to say it's okay there's almost there's lots of time that's okay you can push more so yeah how was this uh comfort this comfort zone helping you uh, to forget everything and concentrate on your sport comfort zone so basically my comfort zone is to play my game and not think about anything else just play what is happening in the court so basically i think i forget what what happens around me and what i have to any pressure that really just goes away when i'm playing the match so i don't think of anything so yeah Right. So you are into open schooling, national uh, uh, open school, and uh, how is uh, this helping you in your uh, performance in your to concentrate on sport? So open schooling, they basically they help me in like so many things, right? So when I when there's exam or something right before or in the tournament, they give me an option to take it any time I want. So I have lots of time to study and actually learn the things, and then write in the exam. So that's how they're helping me, and they don't. give me my homework i i have a permission not to do any of the homeworks assignments well how do you think the sport is uh, improving in mysore so in our state most of the top players are from mysore and um, there is laksh dia amit hardik um ruti sinjana kaurav and yeah like all of these players win and kohana jn they they all Uh, win for our state at a young age you are doing so well and bringing a lot of laurels for my so and the state uh, wish you all well in the near future and wish you all the good luck uh, do well thank you